The first game of BVB's Southeast Asian Tour takes them to Singapore to take on the Lion City Sailors. A number of players away at the World Cup in Qatar. However, that gives the youngsters a chance to shine in black and yellow. Jaden Braff, Broshinsky, Pajalic, just to name a few, all in the starting lineup. Daniel Marlin, the standout player in the first half. However, it was the youngster Pullman who had the first real chance of the game, forcing a fantastic save. Plenty of pace and power, but just couldn't find that bottom left corner. It was one-way traffic all night in Singapore with Dortmund quite clearly the better side, even without some of their big names. And the youngsters were really showing up and turning out one of the veterans, however, denied by the woodwork just under 20 minutes in. Initial shot blocked and then Phoenix Paslak off the post. The keeper getting a touch on it though, so it would go down as a save. The first goal then, also with a little bit of help from the Sailors. An unfortunate one there as the ball bobbled through a seat of white shirts eventually coming off the defender and into the far corner to give Dortmund their lead. But a good build-up play once again. Daniel Marlin with the ball across the box. And sadly, Amirul Adli bin Azmi with the touch. That would help it past his own keeper and into that side netting. 34 minutes now and Dortmund eagerly looking for a second coming forward with chance after chance. Lovely ball back inside and very nearly the second goal. Danger not quite over. Daniel Marlin, nifty footwork and a toe poke into the roof of the net. His first of the night. Dortmund second as they remain in complete control and seem to be enjoying themselves as well. Braff with the ball back across to Marlin, who still had work to do, but did it extremely impressively. BVB not done before the break. Last minute of the half, it's Braff again, Marlin again, goal again. 3-0. The two combining really well throughout the first 45. And two goals as a result, three in total. Showing just why the youngsters should be taken seriously here at BVB. A rich history of developing young players and a history that seems to be continuing well into the future as well. Into the second half we go. A number of changes with the likes of Michel, Reichhoff, Collins, Papadopoulos and Yinma all in. But one more player would join the party as well. And that was Samuel Bamba arriving late at the back post in the 65th minute. Great play from Yinma. Lovely little floated cross. Reichhoff can't get there. Bamba can. And just like that, BVB with another goal. Now 4 nothing up. The Sailors didn't have too many chances going forward. However, they did have this one in the 67th minute. And it was a well-taken goal by Gabriel Quack. A man who scored on plenty of occasions for his sight here in this stadium. But that will be one he remembers and remembers well against Dortmund. Does well to lose Papadopoulos, drags it back across. And Lotka in goal cannot keep it out. Lotka, of course, coming on to replace Maya in the second 45. But BVB were quick to set the record straight again. And it was that man Bamba once more. Bags himself a brace, picking up the pieces after Rykov's shot was blocked. Still had work to do. Little drop of the shoulder to lose the defender, settle himself, and then slot it home from a close range. A well-taken goal from the 18-year-old. Five would then become six, and not long later, into the final 10 minutes, Rykov denied once again. Had plenty of chances, but he wouldn't be denied his goal. Come the end of play, credit to Prince Arning who didn't give up on it once the ball came his way and does ever so well to pick out Rykov for an easy tap-in. Fantastic play from the youngster who joined from Ajax. Loses his defender, slots it back across the face of goal. And a simple finish for Rykov as he gets his name on the score sheet as well. 
Just a moment later, and Yinma, and Yinma, lovely run, lovely finish, 6 1. Well, a number of established players in the starting lineup in the first half into the second, and it would be a squad full of youngsters, and they were eager to impress with a number of them getting their names on the score sheet. Edin Tazic will be very pleased with the performances put together. One man who will be extremely pleased himself. Well, 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 how about that for a goal from Faris Ramli to salvage something yet again for the Sailors. A moment for him to saviour. And a really well taken goal. One touch to lose Papadopoulos and then curls it into the top left corner. Final score 7 2. BVB back in action on Monday when they head to Malaysia to take on Johor Darul Tazim. But a well rounded performance from the vets, the youngsters, and everyone in black and yellow here in Singapore.